Hi guys, it's Daily Matic here. In this video, I'm going to be teaching you how to limit the amount of characters in PHP. But before I do that, I'd like to thank everyone that subscribed and watched our very first video. It's our first week and we're very surprised that we already have 210 subscribers and 201 views on our video. So thank you guys for that. Uh, greatly appreciate it. But yeah, so now with the tutorial. So. All you're going to need is a text editor and uh, a way to host it. So you shouldn't really be watching this video if you don't really know much about hosting or anything like that. So to limit the uh, character limit, I'm going to create a function which will make it a lot more easier for you to use, uh, like in scripts or even on WordPress. You can use it on WordPress. I We use it on our dailymatic.tv uh, WordPress website. So if you guys want to go and check that out, you can. So uh, let's start off by creating the function, and uh, I think we will call the function shorten. Uh, so function, uh, it's a function shorten, and then here we're going to have the string, so the text that was given, and then the length. So now this function is going to do a few things, it's going to count, so let's do this, str len, which will get the length, and in here we need to put the string, so it gets the length of the string, and then we do this, uh, which basically means if it's, if anything this side is bigger than the string, it's going to do something, <laughs> yeah, yeah, so then what we need to type is length, and then do that. And echo the string out. But we also need to put an else. And let's put. Um, you know what? Let's call it YouTube. Uh, equals. So it's going to be substring. So st s u b s t r. And then some brackets and string, and then a zero, and then a length, and then a dot. And what this will do, this is going to add the the three dots at the very end. So you can either change this to like read more or something like that. But for now, I'm going to leave it at the uh, three dots, and then I'm going to put echo. YouTube. Make sure you put that there. And now what you need to do, so where we're going to use it, so let's make a string. So let's just write something out. Oh, that's not what's happened. So that's going to be our string for now and then so we want to shorten this so say if we have a blog layout you don't really want the whole entire blog post to be showing so what we're going to do is we're going to shrink the string down to a certain length and now we can pick the certain length or if you decide to in the future you can set the length so that it's always like the same length unless you want to you know but normally with if you're going to use wordpress this is pretty easy to use WordPress, very very easy to integrate but if you need help with that just comment below and I'll possibly release a little snippet either on the website or even in the comment section for you to then copy and paste into your site so then to use it what you need to do is you need to type shorten so this will then call the call the function and here we are going to have to put string so that's the string as you can also see it up here it's a string you don't have to call this string, this can be called anything, it could be text. You know, let's actually just uh, make it less confusing for you. Change that to uh, text. And then here you need to put the amount of characters you want. So let's just put this to 100. And let's just test this out. So it should be... Okay. 
Okay, so we just had a bit of a uh, technical issue with the ports. It appears that Skype was using the port 80, which is the port that is needed to connect the browser to the server. So, as you can see, it's actually limited the amount of characters that are shown. Now, this is a really cool way to limit the amount of characters that are shown on blogs, websites, or anything. Uh, it could also be used for messages, I suppose, or titles if you like on a forum. But yeah, if you need any more help, uh, always comment in the description or visit our website where we'll have loads more tutorials and possibly even more in-depth tutorials for you. So guys, please rate, comment and subscribe and I'll be seeing you in the next video.